Hello and welcome to another Minecraft video and today I'm going to be showing you a uh, combination lock but as you might have seen in one of my previous videos I'm going to be using um, a partly conditional RS Norlatch array which resets when a button is pressed in the incorrect order uh, but what you see here in the green wall uh, this is a programmable scrambler so basically what will this do will do it will it will change uh say if you pressed a button uh in the first line it can move it to the third line so i'll give you a quick demonstration of this now um as you see here this is the buttons of course the signs wouldn't be here but it's just to help me remember <clears throat> so if we press 1 2 3 and 4 the door opens and then here's a reset button you could attach this to a pressure plate or whatever and the door closes now this thing here is um, basically changing this input and putting it onto another wire or the same wire it doesn't matter and to uh, code it in it's a bit more bit less you know useful as last time as in the uh, bank system where you just have levers underground this one you actually have to go into the um, arrangement but it's still easier than having to rearrange all the wires yourself so basically with this um, with this you have the line that you want it to be set up so that is in its off state right now so if power comes through here only this light will be able to turn on all these other levers are making sure that this light here doesn't turn on these repeaters here are to stop the power from the lever going back onto here and stopping all of them um, and basically the initial inputs are just branched over each other to the different rows of this setup a uh, schematic will be available in the uh, description and now this is what you've probably seen before if you've seen my previous video uh, this just detects if it's in a incorrect order so if this line is still on when another uh, pulse comes through then it will reset the line and then here we just have a simple multi input AND gate uh, you can just attach this to the last one if you wanted to uh, but this is just to double check that all of them have gone before opening the door okay um, thank you very much for watching if you want any tutorials for anything you saw here uh, please just ask thank you very much see you next time